Hello everyone, welcome to story time. And I should say zoophonics time too because we have one, two, three friends joining us from our zoophonics family today. It's our basket. And I have today, and you got some to make puppets in the mail. I have K.O. Kangaroo and Lizzie Lizard. It's harder to see her, she's a little bit flat. And I, you already met Missy Mouse with the story, but she's back today also. So here are their pictures and their cards. So let's see here. K.O. Kangaroos is, oh, she fell down. Right here is her picture. And K.O. Kangaroo, you can see she has boxing gloves on. Boxing, it's like she, they make punching no, shapes. She doesn't want to do that too much because she has her little Joey. A Joey is a, is a baby with her. But they, she says this, ka, and they, she goes like this. She, oh, she kicks up her foot, <laughs> and she kicks, and she kicks her arm like this, and moves them, and says ka, ka, like that, which is also sounds like Katina's cat, Katina cat's sound, doesn't it? Ka, ka. Only this is ka. It's um, with a k. That's a k for ko kangaroo. I'm gonna put her right here for the story. Welcome, Ko, and your little Joey, and Lizzie Lizard. <gasps> Lizzie Lizard's letter, it's like this, it's like a one. And Lizzie Lizard likes to lay on her log like this. And she says, looks in the sun. She likes to bask in the sun and she says, oh. What you do is you put your tongue at the roof of your mouth and say, oh, Lizzie Lizard, welcome. Welcome, K.O. Kangaroo. Go ahead and go back there with your picture. And, because there's Missy Mouse. Hi, I'm glad to be back. And Missy Mouse takes a piece of cheese to her mouth and she says, and eats it and says, mmm, mmm. That's what, what her shape, for her letter is and there she is you can see her eating cheese she's like hiding in there oh she's excited for a story the story we're going to read today starts with the same letter that Lizzie Lizard's name starts with oh oh and that would be llama and some of you might have read this oh that's not the right right llama book I wanted this llama book <laughs> there are a lot of llama books out there. This says, this is where you start reading, llama llama red pajama. Anna Dudney is the author. I love these books, these llama books. There's the title page. It's also illustrated by Anna Dudney. These are good things to think about when you're getting ready for bed at night. Sometimes we have to be patient as we're trying to get to sleep. Llama Llama Red Pajama reads a story with his mama. Mama kisses baby's hair. Mama Llama goes downstairs. It's like he was all tucked in. <gasps> llama Llama Red Pajama feels alone without his mama. Baby Llama wants a drink. Mama's at the kitchen sink. Llama Llama Red Pajama calls down to his Llama Mama. He's calling out Mama. Mama says she'll be up soon. Baby Llama hums a tune. Humming is like singing but not open your mouth. It's just <laughs> like that. Llama Llama Red Pajama waiting, waiting for his Mama. Mama isn't coming yet. Baby Llama starts to fret. Fretting is like getting upset. Starting to kind of be antsy that way. Llama Llama Red Pajama whimpers softly for his mama. A whimper's a soft kind of cry. Mama Llama hears the phone. Oh, the phone rang when he wanted his mama. How does that make you feel when that happens? Baby Llama starts to moan. Ooh. 
Llama, llama, red pajama, listens quiet for his mama. What is mama llama doing? Baby llama starts boo-hooing. Llama, llama, red pajama, hollers loudly for his mama. Baby llama stomps and pouts. Baby llama jumps and shouts. <gasps> Look at his face, he looks scared. Llama, llama, red pajama, in the dark without his mama. Eyes wide open, covers drawn. Drawn is like they're brought up to his face. <gasps> what if mama llama's gone? Uh-oh, look at his mouth. Llama, llama, red pajama, weeping, wailing for his mama. Will his mama ever come? Mama, llama, run, run, run! Uh-oh. Mama's heard that and she's freaking out. <laughs> Wondering what's wrong. It's like she ran into his room. Baby llama, what a tizzy. Sometimes mama's very busy. Please stop all this llama drama and be patient for your mama. Look, he feels kind of bad for being so loud and yelling maybe. Little llama, don't you know, Mama Llama loves you so. Mama Llama's always near, even if she's not right here. Ah. Llama Llama Red Pajama gets two kisses from his mama. Snuggles, pillow, soft and deep. Baby Llama goes to sleep. Uh, we'll have to read another one of the llama books at our next story time or one really soon. So I hope, did you like that KO? Ka, ka. Oh, she's kicking out. Oh. How about Lizzie? Yep, they both said they liked it. And of course, Missy Mouse is over there jumping up and down. She loves any stories. All right, everyone say bye. See you next time. Have a great week.